What is up, my packet people, my packet heads, dropping back in. How's everybody doing? All right, so I'm super excited about something. I wanted to tell you about it, and that is my new Try Hack Me room about Wireshark filters. So if you do have a Try Hack Me account, even if you're not a subscriber, you can go out there and you can register for one for free, and then you should be able to access my room. I went ahead and I linked it down in the description below. But I thought I'd give you just a bit of a preview in this video Video. Note, this is not a full walkthrough. This is just showing you what's out there because right now you can't search for it and find it. You got to know how to go look for it. That's why I'm sharing this video with you. But let's go ahead and do just a high level look at this new room. All right, so here I'm at tryhackme.com. Uh, Wireshark filters is the link. So you should just be able to throw that in and be able to access it. So what I did here is I wanted to make it interactive and hands on to learn how to filter. All right, as we know, filtering can be a bit of a pain, especially when we're first learning Wireshark. So that's exactly Exactly what this room is designed to help you to do get some more hands-on with Wireshark filters so after a general intro you can actually do all of these labs locally on your machine just hit these little download links and those will give you the PCAPs that you can follow along with or what you can do at the start we can just start a virtual machine and all of the PCAPs are going to be available for you on that virtual machine within try hack me so what kind of filters are you gonna learn well first we start with protocol filters so some general stuff IP TCP, UDP, DNS, those kinds of things. And then we start to dig a little further. So IP filters, conversation filters. Uh, what about when we're filtering for a network? How about when we want an individual IP or if we want to remove a certain IP? We also learn about certain operators. So what I'm gonna be doing is saying, hey, in this IP address, go ahead and apply a filter for this type of traffic. Then tell me how many packets that you got. Now there could be more than one way to filter for what I'm asking for, and that's okay. A lot of times it's your highway. Sometimes it's very specific, but other times you can use your creative freedom to design a filter that meets what we're looking for. Okay, past that, we're down to DNS filters, special operators, putting it all together, filtering for scans. So there's some scan activity on your network. How can you quickly filter for it? Watch for any type of strange scanning activity going on. Also filtering for usernames and passwords. So how we can use that feature within Wireshark. So I'm super excited about this Try Hack Me room. Uh, this is just one of what I have planned ahead. So really go ahead and check out this room. Comment down below what you thought about it. Go and reach out to me through whatever means. Let me know uh, if you want to see more content like this. I know Try Hack Me wants to build out the packet analysis part of the platform. So I'm trying to help them to do that. But go ahead and check it out, packet people. I'm interested to see what you think. And I'll see you guys again.